This would be the 64 liter. Right off the bat would be the 64-3 gilt. She's got a little bit of like a white hind leg flank on the other side, how I remember her. And again, these are the TOUs, Timber, Secret Society, Gain Control. Um, this sow would have raised the boar we sold Laird's last year that was the My Intention son called Full Intention. And also, this sow had a couple daughters that were shown amongst Iowa and Illinois that competed very well um, in their heavier classes. And uh, anyways, with that said, 64-3. We're going to talk about these two gilts. In my opinion, I flat love these things in terms of their unique, of their just zoo bread looking, but yet still have a stout mug on them. And I think these gilts, long term, have about as good breeding value of just zoo creature, freaked out. I don't even know how to describe these things, but 64 3 there in the back. If you can't tell, this litter is going to get the A plus marking every day of the week, in my opinion. And then we're going to go ahead and talk about the belt here, which is the 64 4 gilt. And again, same thing. Just the way these guys, is, these girls, just necks and heads, I mean, they just look like absolute show ponies that can go out every weekend and look the part. You know, and then also talking about the board TOU, which is the board here at our place. You know, I don't know size wise where these will end up or how long they'll last in terms of, you know, I guess if you get to state fair with them, most state fairs can be 340 or something in the guilt show, anyways. They'll have enough fun throughout the summer. But if you're looking for that elite jackpot guilt, but last you all the way through the summer in terms of best bang for the buck, I think these 64, 3, and 4 gilts are about as good as it gets. I'll be honest with you, um, I go back and forth between 3 and 4. Man, flip the quarter, get which one's in your budget, and just try to go with it. 